Once upon a time, there was a love for stories, for the magic words passed down from generation to generation, colorful books, woodland nooks, scary creatures, and great loves. The stories came to life with the voices of mothers and grandmothers. Children were ready to live out amazing adventures, catapulted from the warmth of their blankets into fantasy worlds. There was all of this once upon a time, and there still is, thanks to Le Favole del Val di Chienti, Tales of Val di Chienti, an initiative in which stories and fantasy come together to enhance the beauty of the territory of Macerata, exploring the places, history and legends that continue to live on in time with a renewed energy. Le Favole del Val di Chienti, a project of the Val di Chienti shopping center in Macerata, Italy, and Cogest Italia, was created for cultural, educational, and welfare aims in collaboration with the Fine Arts Academy of Macerata and primary schools of the catchment area, sponsored by the city and province of Macerata. The result was the publication of a volume with 12 stories written by children and illustrated by participants of Ars in Fabula, the Master in Illustration in Publishing program of Fabrica della Favole. The book was distributed against a free offer and the proceeds were donated to Ambolt, an association in the Marche region for the assistance and care of children with leukemia and cancer. The Val di Chienti Shopping Centre has created a project to enhance the values of the tradition and territory. Entire classes, illustrators, volunteer groups, the public of the centre and local institutions were able to work together as a team and to come into contact with historical sites and natural wonders of their land by way of the imaginations of the younger generations. The project has also helped the children who participated learn more about the area, about integrating different cultures and backgrounds, and has created a communication tool made available to the community with the ultimate aim of supporting Ambolt, an important reality in the market area. The project's main objectives involved the promotion of the identification of the Val di Chienti Shopping Centre brand name linked to its being a supporter of the values of culture, tradition and territory, as well as very attentive to social issues. To achieve this, they wanted to create a communication tool that could represent the original values of the tradition and beauty of the area, while involving the younger generations, the Fine Arts Academy of Macerata, and institutions for finalizing the editorial product. The square of the Val di Chienti shopping center served instead as a means of spreading the word about the project and the resulting work. Cogest Italia, devised the project along with the communications agency Proxima SPA, a project that was presented in a letter sent to the primary schools in Macerata and the provincial area. Fifty classes responded positively. Then it was the turn of the twelve professional illustrators. Each illustrator brought to life one of the twelve finalist stories, selected by a jury. In the end, 2,500 copies of the volume of tales were printed. A press conference was organized after the publication of Le Favole del Val di Chienti, attended by local and national newspapers, editors of several websites, and a local television network. A party was organized for the project's official launch and for the distribution of the book that coincided with the anniversary of the shopping center and the famous Italian actor-comedian Nino Frassica was invited. An advertising campaign was created for the communication of the initiative and subsequent promotion of the anniversary and fundraiser through the widespread use of newspapers, radio and internal communications. In addition, the fundraising for Ambolt was carried out in an ad hoc location in the gallery. Le Favole del Val di Chienti, a project that synthesizes children's imagination, the illustrator's artistic skill, solidarity and love of the territory.